Hey book beauties, welcome back. I hope you had an amazing weekend. Let me tell you something. I am ready to talk about a series that I have not seen here on TikTok and it blew me out of the freaking water. Find Me is book one by Ashley Ross Tech. A year old girl who her family gets completely slaughtered by a stalker and then she relocates and her neighbors are four hot brothers. Let's get into it. She does not skimp on talking about all of the specifics of the night that her family was murdered. And throughout all of the books, it is brought up multiple times. So please, please read the trigger warnings on this. So if you're good with the trigger warnings, we start off with Shiloh. And one night she comes home and her dad is completely murdered. She unfortunately um, has to watch her mother and then her twin get murdered in front of her. Now, she did get away and you see throughout the book how that happened and that night unfolds. Her uncle, Logan, takes guardianship of her and moves her to Alaska for a year. She just kind of learns how to protect herself and then he's ready to go back to being the U.S. Marshal and finding this stalker and murder. And she's like, okay, well, I guess I'm just going to move to Arizona and try to live my life. So Shiloh meets the boys across the street. Her uncle went ahead and left her because she, he is on the hunt for the killer. She goes to school and Colton Creed are the twins and they are immediately drawn to her. She's drawn to them. But one thing is she was the very good twin. Shiloh has always, you know, done the safe bet. She's a virgin. She's never done anything. She did not leave unscathed from everything. She has scars everywhere. Um, she obviously is suffering with major PTSD and depression. So she's like, listen, you know, we can be kind of friends, but I gotta, you gotta stay away from me. She meets the other two, which is Keelan, who's 23 and Knox, who's 25. Um, they have also went th through their own grief and she is slowly starting to kind of infiltrate their lives and they're doing the same with her. They see the same pain as they have went through. She can't lose anyone else. She goes through it through the book. There are a lot of things that continue to happen to her. It's like, what else is going to happen to this girl? Like, what is going to be the tipping point before she just is like, I'm done? Guys, I, I haven't been so enamored, like, on the edge of my seat in in books in a really long time. They're like, oh, what series do you think goes unknown? This series. And they suck you in. And the whole time you're like, leave her alone. But she perseveres. These men start to really love her and they create this family. And the secrets that unfold and the memories and the nightmares and the PTSD. Like, I, I will say this is one of my favorite series like in that darker romance that I have read in quite a long time. It was incredible.